Here's your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. Well, outside of just a passing snow flurry tomorrow, and even that is just a small chance, the weather looking dry next several days. Big temperature changes ahead, though, for the weekend. In the meantime, we're, we're looking good. A Newport now into clear skies and the temperatures that are dropping through the mid and upper 20s. Of course, very uh, changeable skies today. I mean, it was all over the place, back and forth between dark clouds, sunshine, flurries, brief you know, heavy snow squalls in some areas, but a lot quieter this evening, and it should stay that way right on through the overnight early tomorrow morning. So dry skies tonight overnight. We are trending colder over the next several days, especially uh, come this weekend. And that, the one downside with the weekend, not only much colder, but both Saturday and Sunday, uh, very windy, so unfortunately we have to talk about uh, wind chills this weekend. High temps today briefly reaching the upper 30s to a lower 40s, including 41 in Providence. The average high is about 37, 38, so we were close to average. A little cooler for tomorrow. We'll take a look at the Oakland Beach and Warwick now. Clear skies, temperature now coming in at 27, and Smithfield uh, colder at 24, so some locations will get down to you know, 16, 17, 18 degrees uh, by daybreak tomorrow around 5. 5, 6 a.m. So the system that came through today with some of the scattered snow showers and squalls is moving offshore. We're clear for now. Our next system, and it, is, it isn't much, we're not getting a storm tomorrow, but system across the upper Great Lakes. This will swing through northern New England tomorrow, and for a time, it'll throw some extra clouds for a little bit, mixing with the sunshine and just that outside chance of either a passing a light snow shower or flurry. Better part of the day is actually dry. And you can see the core of the coldest air in purple and gray sitting right on top of a southeastern Canada and New England. You see some of these temperatures up in northern New England getting close to zero. And so uh, we'll keep things chilly for tomorrow. Brief moderation in temperature Friday afternoon before it really drops off this weekend. So the forecast will step you through it hour by hour. Watch the time bar right up in here. Tomorrow morning, early on, it's dry. But look at the temperatures at 8 o'clock in the morning, only down to about 20, 25. A kind of a cloud hazy sun mixture and then watch very closely right here a little blip of white coming through uh, late morning early afternoon maybe a passing snow shower or flurry nothing more than that and then notice how skies start to clear out but not until three four o'clock in the afternoon uh, clearing skies from west to east clouds push offshore sets the stage for a clear dry night tomorrow night tomorrow night not as cold as tonight in fact by 11 o'clock tomorrow night it's still in the upper 20s to low 30s so chilly but not as cold as tonight so so here's the hour by hour breakdown a cloud hazy sun mixture tomorrow morning cold start in the 20s again late morning early afternoon a flurry or a snow shower in a few spots temperatures tomorrow afternoon pretty close to average where we should be for this time of year which is essentially the mid and upper 30s a little cooler in our higher elevations with partly sunny skies upper 30s across southeastern mass slight chance of that flurry but a better part of your thursday is dry looking at a decent friday good news at the weekend look at the sunshine both saturday and sunday but the temperatures sharply colder and the wind gusts you know 30 35 miles per hour Mike and Shannon so both of these days we're talking about wind chills in the teens and 20s snow lovers uh, Monday night Tuesday we'll watch that closely for the chance for some snow feeling more like the season okay Tony thanks yeah. just how high will